السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس اینڈ یا ویورس ٹوڈے وی ول بی ڈسکسنگ دا ٹاپک اور بندو سار بندو سارا واز اے مورین کنگ آفٹر چندر گپت موریا چندر گپت موریا رولڈ فرام تھری ٹو ون ٹو ٹو نائن ایٹ بی سی and this was who ruled from 298 later bc to 272 bc the greeks used to call him this bindusar amritu chatas amritu chatas which means slayer of foes سمپلی catch the person or enemy and kill him according to some tamil sources he conquered southern india over taranath t a r a n a t h taranath was a tibetan tibetan means tibetan is a modern Although it is not now because this land portion is now conquered by China. If it is China, it is Tibet, it is Nepal here, here it is India. And whatever we say that is this Taranoth lived in this area that it is he was a Tibetan monk. Monk we know. the follower of the buddhist religion <coughs> buddhism that this tibetan monk taranath has said that bindusar had conquered the land between two seas so which means the land would have been between two seas if it is bay of bengal it is arabian sea that means this is the southern India which would have been conquered by this Bindusar. Bindusar was a follower of Ajvika sect. Ajvika sect. religion and this ajvika sect was founded by makhali putta gosala although you do not need it here to mention but if you are at higher levels of studying history then you have to know it that ajvika sect of was founded by makhali putta gosala who was the friend of Vardhaman Mahavir. Vardhaman Mahavir founded Jainism. His friend was Mahadiputta Gosala. And this friend made another religion which was beyond that of Jainism called as Ajvika sect. and bindusar was the follower of this ajvika sect in the court of a bindusara dimakas in the court of this bindusara dimakas an egyptian ambassador comes which was sent or who was sent by antiochus first antiochus first antiochus first 
Az egy kind of Syria. Bindus are requested this Timacus to send three things from Syria. Bindus are told and you was first that three things be given to him to India. Number one was philosopher. Philosopher may be please be sent to India so that he may give some sort of knowledge or philosophy to we uneducated Indians at that time. Number two were pigs. It is dried pigs, a fruit. We know. Number third was sweet wine. These were the three things which he demanded. But out of these three, two were sent. Figs and sweet wine was sent to the the king but not for the philosopher because why from the reply came that philosophers from our side are not sent as gifts it shows the importance of education at that time that is why western or Europeans had been very educated and developed from the very past and according to my view I can say we Asian people and India as well are very much underdeveloped um, that of Europeans. Thank you.